Hello, I'm Dr. John Rostin, and this is my President's Minute. So thank you for joining me uh, today. I've, uh, I'm hoping that each one of you has had a, a good summer break. Uh, it's a time for us to kick back, ease up a little bit before we head into the busy months of, of the fall. You know, working with our students, especially uh, welcoming, uh, getting to know our first year students is such an important thing. And these, uh, these young people, their enthusiasm, their talent, um, they will be our future leaders. And we're able to plant that seed early on, right from the beginning. Already we have seen, just for all graduating classes um, from our schools, just what a, a role they have played and continue to play in leadership for our profession. So with our, uh, our optometry students, so really it's our, our job as individual doctors to be an encourager for them, uh, to get to know them, uh, help them on their way. I'd encourage you to invite them to a local optometry society meeting. Take them out to lunch. Uh, have them shadow you in your office to get a sense of what it is that we do uh, day to day. So uh, be a part of that. Join us. Let's help these young people uh, uh, really uh, to move ahead. So we at COA are very excited about the creation of our student section, which is uh, up and running. We're looking forward to capturing 100% student enrollment in the section from all three schools of optometry here in California. As a part of the section, we've established a Facebook group, which is already beginning to be a real uh, helpful tool for allowing our students to be involved uh, and to participate uh, uh, through that. With our students and looking to our future, we have this real opportunity for them to help catapult our profession ahead in ways that we cannot even imagine. So also, uh, here in the next uh, week and a half, COA will be participating in a back-to-school eye health fair in the community of Salinas, California. This is another great opportunity for us as a profession to be out there in our community, serving the needs of those that have a need for access to these services, and also to be able to share the name of COA with those uh, throughout the state. So I would encourage you to join us on Saturday, August 9th in Salinas. Uh, please contact the COA office uh, and we can give you the details for being a part of that. So thanks again for joining me for my President's Minute and I uh, just uh, hope that everyone will have a great uh, uh, coming fall, winter, uh, and a great, uh, great school year.